Okay, open camera. Test it one more time. Got everything set the way I want it. And I'm going to pan around this time. Just do regular video instead of just my screen. Show my rack, I guess. My computer rack with my audio gear up in the top half. And then my laptop and some boxes I had out. I was stacking my camera that's uh, mounted to the that's rubber banded to the cassette deck it's sitting upside down right now because it'll fall over uh, I sat on those boxes so I could do the screen a while ago there's some computers standing up right in the rack and I can turn on the light I finally figured that out but I'm not going to do it now because it's pretty fiddly <laughs> See if the autofocus is working okay. I think it's okay. There's my old TV. I'm always talking about that. I watch TV on every night. That's Monkey Ward's Montgomery Ward's TV from the mid, early to mid 80s. Still works. And I use the laptop here. Has a nice video output right over here. And then just run some of my cable over there. And the audio goes to my stereo system. And down there is not a computer. That is my power supply amp. I have two computer power supplies in there. It's running right now. And the lights are just little 12 volt lights that go with cars to let me know it's running. There's two of them in there. And I have two car amps in there. So they're running on 12 volts. Peter went to sleep. And it uh, works pretty good. Uh, first I had them uh, wired together to make 24, up to 24 volts. and uh, But taking the, uh, you have to ground lift one of them to do that. And that caused bad buzzing. So I changed it back to separated them and made them both grounded. And... Uh, not talking about what's on the screen, I'm talking about this. It's an old Dell computer box that got killed by lightning. The motherboard did. And the power supplies are out of different things, I don't remember what. But, um, and there's my charge. Of course, on top, that's just my chargers and power strips. This is how I turn it on and off right here. You just use that power strip switch. Turn it on when I get up and turn it off when I go to bed. And then I also use this my old jam box, my old Awa jam box. A I W A. It's a 50 watt jam box and speakers are put around the room here. So I actually end up with fairly decent sound. I can actually knock everybody else out of the house. I got some uh, good size. Everything's so dusty, I hate to show it, but. Down there with my dusty boots is uh, it's a magnet box, I believe it is, from back in the 80s. Speakers with 10 inch dry, woofer drivers. And uh, over here, I'm, I need to move some of that stuff. It's starting to block my sound. That's a car speaker, 6x9 triaxle. And uh, over there's the other one. So yeah, depending on where I'm sitting, I hear one better, one side better than the other, but it's fine. And if there's anything going on in the uh, video when I'm watching video, that uh, the, and there's the Awa speakers are down underneath everything, can't see them too good. But if anything's going on, I do hear that you know effect of like somebody coming from the back, the other side of the room or something. It's not, it's wired in stereo, not in the you know 5.1 or anything like that. Uh, I would have to have more amps. I got one, two, and down here, three up there. Yeah, I've got three amps, and I haven't really. Well, I mean, all these computers that I have. I mean, some of them will do 7.1 even, but uh, it's coaxial output, and of course these don't have coaxial input, so. Stereo is good for me. I like that just fine. It's what I'm actually used to. I've heard a few nice surround sound systems. They're pretty cool, but and one day I would wouldn't mind doing that if I had more space. 
do it, but just in this room here, I, you know, it's not that good. To, I, I mean, it's not big enough for really to do all that anyway. So anyway, and that's the uh, open camera Google Play page. That's the app I'm using it. <coughs> Testing it <coughs> since I reinstalled it after it broke. So it's working now. All right, this dog button.